So this lotion is for you if you are caramel skin tone. This is going to brighten up your skin. It's going to get rid of every dull complexion. It's going to make your skin glow effortlessly. <music> Hi lovelies, welcome to Skin Glow Beauty Castle. And if this happens to be your first time stopping by this channel, I mean your very first time seeing this face, oh my God, where have you been? Anyway, you are welcome to a beautiful channel you are going to be so, so, super, super addicted to. No jokes. And to all my returning subscribers, you already know I got much love for you. I love you. Thank you so much for sticking with me. Know that I appreciate you. Thank you so much. So today I am super, super excited as you can see. And I'm going to be sharing with you beauties how you can safely and effectively pro-mix a caramel glow and brightening body lotion. Oh yeah, so this is for the caramel skin people. Uh-huh. So, you know, all the whites has been about whitening this, whitening that. So some persons were like, what about us? The brown skin girls, the caramel skin tone, what about us? So this lotion is for you if you are caramel skin tone. This is going to brighten up your skin. It's going to get rid of every dull complexion. It's going to make your skin glow effortlessly. We give you an even skin tone, and trust me, you are going to love it. So if this sounds like something you're very much interested in, Cross with me to my formulating table and let's get a job done. Hi lovelies, welcome to my workstation. So in here I have my cocoa butter and my shea butter. These are beautiful nourishing butters for the skin and if you're caramel skin tone, you're brown skin, this is just perfect for you. It is very much important in our formulation today. Right here I have my Kojic Depalmated Powder. This powder is very good. It's a good skin lightening powder. It clears edge spots and scars and has anti-aging properties. It has lightening effect also and it contains um, antimicrobial properties. So this is very important. Right here I have my grapeseed oil. This is lightweight. It can be used by all skin type. It penetrates into the skin easily. It has um, a non-greasy texture and it is very very good. I'll be adding in two tablespoons of our grapeseed oil to dissolve our Kojic Depalmated Powder. So I'll be using the double boiler method for this to dissolve both the Kojic um, Depalmated Powder and also our um, shea butter and our cocoa butter. So a Kojic Depalmated Powder can only be dissolved in oil. So please take note of that. Right here, I have my whitening base cream. This cream is very rich. It contains a lot, a lot of beautiful ingredients. Yes. So, but I'll leave, uh, if you can't find the whitening base cream, there are some lotions, recommendations I'll leave for you to use, all right? So in here, I'll be adding in uh, melted cocoa butter and shea butter. Here we have our dissolved Kojic Depalmated Powder, the one with dissolved and grapeseed oil. So here it is, we're adding it into our base cream. So like I said, if you're caramel skin tone and you cannot find a whitening base cream to use for this production, for this recipe, you can use these lotions. Right on the screen, you can use them. But if you are brown skin, then you can use these lotions you see on the screen. here I have my raw Egyptian milk. This is a skin brightening and a skin glowing milk. All right, This will not whiten you. It will glow your skin and brighten out your complexion. Please make sure you get the original. 
this smells like milk it smells amazing and then to give your skin that creamy you know that creamy look skin like milk skin like butter yeah that's what you're gonna get Here we have our DIY brightening card oil. A tutorial on how to make this will be coming up soon on this channel. Watch out for it. So I'm adding in two tablespoons of our brightening and glowing card oil. So here I have my card seed essential oil. This is also great. This is skin bright now. As well, it contains, you know, carrot contains vitamin A and carotenoids. It really, really brightens and glows the skin. So I'm just using a few drops, like 10 drops of a carrot seed essential oil. Here I have my 42-hour serum. This serum can be used on the face and on the body. It is very good. I mean, I cannot even, I cannot say it enough. This is very good. Just enable to buy the original 42-hour serum to glow your skin, brighten out your complexion and fade out dark spots. Here I have my Citroclair Serum, it's a skin brightening serum. Here I have my Miracle Derm Tube. Miracle Derm Tube will help to fight against any form of reactions. It works against stretch marks, green veins, any form of um, skin blemishes. Miracle Derm will tackle it. Apart from this lotion giving you a brighter and a beautiful and even skin tone, it's also going to fight against stretch marks, dark spots, white dots and all kinds of skin blemishes. So here I have my Miracle Powder. I call this small but mighty. <laughs> I'm just going to add a pinch of my Miracle Powder. It fights against dark spots, stretch marks, skin blemishes. So this is a very good lotion. But please add just a pinch of Miracle Powder is enough. So I'm adding in my Magic Derma Concentrate in here. So in place of this, you can use the Pimendo um, Concentrate. I'll leave a picture of the Magic Derma Concentrate and the Pimendo Concentrate you can use as an alternative. Here I'm adding in my BB Clear Serum. This is a very good skin nourishing and glowing serum. So in place of this BB Clear Serum, you can also use the Kojic Acid Serum or the Glutathione Serum. It is very, very good as well. Those are glowing and just brightening serums. They are not whitening serums, okay? So I'm going to mix this, I'm going to stir this, I'm going to use my stick blender to blend this properly. And here we have it. Just look at the beautiful consistency we have. Very nice. Because of our base, our base cream was really thick. Make sure your base cream is thick. Here I have my vegetable glycerin. Vegetable glycerin is a natural humectant that locks moisture into the skin, thereby softening, smoothing, and soothing the complexion. So it is very important to add in your vegetable glycerin. I'm gonna stir this in. I'm gonna stir, 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 stir. So right here, I have my Liquid Gemma Plus. We have to preserve this cream so it doesn't go bad in time. So I'm adding my um, Liquid Gemma Plus. The preservative, like I said, is always 0.5 to 1% of your total formulation that you add in. Here I am adding in my chocolate fragrance oil. This is very, very good. It smells amazing. The whole room smells like chocolate. <laughs> the 
so do not mind the color of the chocolate um, fragrance oil all right it will not affect the color of the lotion even in the long run it's going to retain its color it's a beautiful color like this this is it see how beautiful it is you can use this lotion in the day and in the night but please avoid the sun because the sun is not a friend to our skin avoid the sun use this day use this at night and use a sunscreen during the day trust me your skin will love it your brand skin your caramel skin will be beautiful will be flawlessly beautiful Thank you for watching, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Always be good and kind to yourself and others. Peace.